Hello everyone, welcome, how are you doing? Hello, hello! Hello Mongoose, how are you doing? Hope you're having a good day. Hello Ritesh, how are you doing? Hope you're having a good day. Hello Officer, how are you doing? Hope you're having a good day. Hello Selvinus, welcome, how are you doing? Hope you're having a good day. Hello Rancor, how are you doing? Hope you're having a good day. Vorador, hi, how are you doing? Hope you're having a good day. Osis, welcome, hi, hello, how are you doing? Hope you're having a good day. Gotta love that auto uh, downgrade to 144p. I'm so sorry to hear that. I hope um I hope not not everyone is going through that same thing because uh boy boy that sure is not the intention. Uh uh -huh. my my connection seems to be fine, so I don't know. I really hope that's not the case for everyone. Mirwanda, welcome my hello, how are you doing? I hope you're having a good day. Mandy, Rexy, welcome guys, how are you doing? Hope you're having a good day, welcome! Oh no name, welcome, hi, hello, how are you doing? Hope you're having a good day! Um... Hello, doing okay, day passed decently. Okay, sometimes decently is exactly what we need. As long as it's not anything worse than decently. Uh, Crooked Gamer, welcome, hi, hello, how are you doing? Hope you're having a good day, hello! I'm excited to see how you'll do. I'm excited to see how I'll do too. I'm excited. Look, I got myself. I got myself this thingy. I got myself. We have. We have. Uh, this. Which is not showing. Give me a second. We have. This. Which is just a notepad. But I, I'm assuming I'm gonna have to take notes. And for that. For that effect. I got myself. This. Could you hear that? I hope you could hear that. 
So that's what the cooking was. Yes! I've had this. I've had this thing. Listen. I've had this thing for months. Maybe even a year. Who knows? Actually, I've had this thing for a year. I never could figure out where to use it. So we're using it to... <laughs> Nice, you bought notepad. Oh, you the typing thing. The typing thing. It even has a ding. Yes, it does. I'm so happy about it. Well, so immersive. I know, right? Uh, so we need an actual magnifying glass to see it. What an immersive experience. <laughs> I can make it bigger. I can make it bigger. I can, I just, I, I just, I don't want it to cover much of the game. The idea is for it to only come up right now and then still, but, uh, there, there, is that enough? Shadow Ninja, welcome, my hello, how are you doing? Hope you're having a good day. I have no idea if that sound had to come from the stream or the video was finishing off as it started. I'm sorry, I'm so I messed up. I typed while, while on the, the starting Zeus screen. Sorry I'm late, I, uh, sorry I'm late, I am not here. Don't worry about it, this is not a job. This is not a job, don't, don't apologize, it's all right, hi. How are you? That's what they all say. What do you mean that's what they all say? That's what who says? Um, it does not for everyone's streams. Oh, I'm so, I'm so sad about, here, uh, about that OC, so I'm so sad hearing that. Um, but yeah, I think I heard, uh, I think I said hello to everyone. Keeps polishing gem to avoid the whip. I'm not going to whip you! Stop! I'm not mean, I'm not evil! Hello, I'll probably be listening more than watching today. I know, because you you really don't vibe with the aesthetic of this, which is perfectly understandable. Honestly, it's a little bit like off. Like uh, one bit games are a little bit off for me too, visually, but some of them are so good gameplay. What minute is not my favorite aesthetic, but it's it's such a fun game that I had such fun memories of. Um, only Jim Polishers get in trouble for being late. No, nobody gets in trouble. Nobody gets in trouble for being late. Stop scaring. Stop scaring people. I sprained my wrist and pretty bad yesterday, but other than that, I'm good. How about you? I'm so sorry to hear that. I hope that it gets better. Uh, be very careful with it, uh, do get to a doctor if it lasts long, like the discomfort, and just make sure to, make sure to, to keep it control. You don't want it to get worse. Last thing I'm gonna say, guys, before we get started immediately with the game, I want a, one of you, any one of you, to try the commands that we used to have. I think, I think, I managed to get them back in. I think. Let's see if it let's see if it's true. Somebody somebody pull out a headpad or or a bonk or something. I wanna try. No, not that one! <laughs> the ones that are the ones that were actually available. It works! Okay, guys, we have the we have the commands back. For those of you who are new, we have the headpad, we have the dumb, we have the bonk, and we have a secret one that I haven't told anyone about. But if you guys discover it by yourself, that is your. Thank you, thank you. Can anybody do that? Yes, yes, anybody can do that. Uh, but. We also have one more that it's a secret. While I'm discovering the murder, you guys are going to be discovering... It's Polish. <laughs> well, you don't really need to discover it. If you just give it time, I'm sure that I'll blabber about it. But I thought it was a nice little, a nice little game to offer you. Um, it's not warm. It's not warm. <laughs> Silly. I could probably do a warm though, but I'm not gonna! <laughs> I actually expected it to be warm now! <laughs> Crumpets, welcome! Hello, how are you doing? Hope you're having a good day. Welcome! But yeah, you don't really you don't really have to uh, worry too much about it. Also, 
I'm just realizing that every time somebody uses a command, it's going to do a noise. Whoops! <laughs> I didn't think about that. I really didn't think about that. Oh well. Let's get started with the game. Uh, do tell me if the sound is a little bit too loud. It sounds quite a bit too loud, but I'm not entirely sure. See you tomorrow? Okay, Krampus, I hope you have a great rest of your day. Oh, oh, I hope you didn't get, I hope you didn't get, uh, in trouble the other day. Uh, not serious trouble. And, I uh, thank you so much for dropping by and saying hello. I hope you have a good rest of your day and I hope you have a good shift and everything. Uh, Leo, welcome and hello, how are you doing? Hope you're having a good day, welcome! Uh, we can't hear commands. You can't hear commands? I hear it clicking on the on the typewriter. I really do. I, I hear it clicking on the typewriter every time I I see a command. Um, sounds fine to me, maybe even a little low? Really? Really? Okay, let me... Uh, how about... How about... How about there? Is that better or is it still like too low? Or is it too high now? Maybe the volume is too high now. The music rose right after I said that. <laughs> okay, so bringing it back down. <laughs> bringing it back down. Too loud now? Okay, okay, alright. Okay. So, so, so maybe hopefully that's fine. Hopefully that's okay. I don't remember exactly where I had it, but uh, hopefully this is alright. I'm hoping. We are we are hoping that's all we can do. Okay, um If any of these are the configurations, I didn't touch the configurations at all. No fate solved. Don't worry, we're here to solve them. The game doesn't really have music anyways, just jingles. Oh really? Lost at Sea, 1803, the good ship Oprah Dinn, built 1796, London, 800 tons, 18 feet draught, Captain R. Witterwell, crew 51 men, last voyage to Orient Cape Rendezvous unmet. Contact East India Sai London office for inquiries or testimony. Should I write this down? I'm going to. R. Witterell. R. R. Witterell Captain R Witterell Plus 51 crew We're starting people I'm going to prove that I can think I'm going to prove that I can have a brain Attention, Chief Inspector, Insurance and Claim, London Office, the Honorable East India Company, the Oprah Dinn has returned. Dispatch to Falmouth immediately and prepare a full, full assessment. Kevin, welcome and hello, how are you doing? Hope you're having a good day, welcome! Cost, ooh, good, good guess, good guess. I am trying to figure out how to make that one happen, actually. Um, okay, yeah, welcome and hello, how are you doing? Hope you're having a good day, DJ T. <coughs> Company man woke me up. Said you'd need ferry to the old bread inn. You feeling okay, buddy? Not many eager for that job. Why not? Seems a bit late if you ask. I didn't. <laughs> Ooh! What's in the box? I don't know. What's in the box? In a few minutes. Hey! Ow! Carefully. Are you a pirate now? I don't think so. I think I work in an insurance company or something like that. I wasn't expecting- I'm gonna be honest, I wasn't expecting to be a girl. Oh no. Oh, that's gonna get very annoying. I'm gonna turn it off. <laughs> It was a nice gimmick. I enjoyed you. It's going to be way too annoying. Sorry. No, we are not doing that. Oh, yeah, that's better. Okay, do I grab the thingy? How do I grab the thing? I guess I don't grab the thingy. Okay, I guess I just go. Lol, I, I mean, I tried. I tried. Captain Pink Skills. Oh, Captain Pink Skills. That's a name. It is, it is kind of a very jarring aesthetic. It is a very jarring... Like, look. 
Uh, Bill, can I ring the bell? No, I still don't know how to interact with the game at all. Ellie is worse than a simple pirate in this game. She's a British inspector. I'm the British inspector. No, I can't give you the posh British accent for free. <laughs> you have to vote for it. <laughs> you have to vote for it. Um, insurance company. That's what the East India Co. is. No, but I mean, I am going to... I am going on behalf of the insurance company. I feel like. I feel like. I think it's a great aesthetic. It's a little bit difficult for someone like me who is so... Averse to noticing details. I'm not averse. I just... I'm bad at it. It's too heavy. Can you stop yelling like that? I was staring at a body. You scared me. Where are you? Where is this guy? Can I... Can I just jump? No, it's not gonna let me just jump. Skillbeard just sounded awful in my head. Skillbeard sounds bad, but Take yeah, you said that. Okay, how do I? Okay. Now what? <laughs> now what? Worms don't float. Good thing I'm not a worm. Good thing I'm not a goddamn worm. Huh? Clicky, 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 clicky. Oh, there's a... Sorry, my phone, which I use as a chat, was uh, covering, was covering the, the, the instructions. Return of the Oberdin, a catalog of adventure and tragedy. Preface. I trust that you now find yourself aboard the Oberdin. I expected this day to come, and my every intention was to tell the ship's strange tale within the pages of this book. Regrettably, failing health has allowed me to produce only the basic outline that follows. Your presence on the Obra Dinn is critical. I leave the discovery of its fate and the completion, completion of this book in your hands. The next few pages will seem bewildering at first. All will make sense in time. Use the pocket watch to determine the identity and fate of everyone aboard. Complete each chapter accurately and return the book by guaranteed post to the French Office of Affairs in Morocco. The bargain chapter will remain unknown to you. I possess the details within, but have elected to keep them private for now. What do you mean for now? You're dead. When does now end? Huh? Oh no, a book! It's... I'm not gonna lie. Reading too much is going to be... Whoo, you know. Um, I look away for five seconds and Ellie's already killed someone. No, I didn't kill anyone! I'm here to discover why they died! It sounds like a medical condition. What does? What does? You have all passed that stage, huh? Duh. No, I'm not. I've never been a worm. I've only once when my gem misbehaved. But, you know, that's not... That's not my natural state. The journey, the ship, the crew, life at sea, sketch, glossary, back cover, loose cargo, a bitter cold, murder, the calling... That's a lot. That is a lot. The journey, we have a map. The ship, we have another map. The crew! How come I, can I... Oh, I can enter! I can enter these things! That's good. That's good. We have several people from England, from Sierra Leone, from India, from Wales, Denmark. A lot more from England. Mostly from England. Formosa! That doesn't sound Argentinian, so I'm assuming it's a co an actual country and not the province of my country. Okay, how do I get out of here? Ha! Oh, okay, so map. Well, doesn't seem like our like our looking glass is working pretty well in this map. We'll figure that out. Uh, and not working here either. So, cool. We'll find, we'll find where it works. What is this? Is this supposed to be like pictures of everyone? Is this supposed to be like, who was who? Ooh, we have some women on board. Nice. Formosa and royalty. The people from Formosa were princes, or king and queen, or something. Poor them. Justice- oh. Oh. 
Oh god. Who was that? Wait! That's the king and queen. I. Okay. We're gonna have to figure out a lot of stuff, huh? Part two, on the cargo deck. And then everything else is kind of empty. Mostly empty. Just a couple of, just a couple of notes. Was one of the numbers in red? No, no, it wasn't. It was my imagination. Can, can I get out of the book? No. Can I get out of the book? How do I get out of the, how do I get out of the book? Skim through the entire book first. Oh my God. Oh my God. Okay, fine. We're rushing. We're rushing. The book is empty, man. On the cargo deck. Okay, got it. On the cargo deck. What else? On the... In the port walk. On the cargo deck. Okay. On the bow. Okay. On the deck, whatever. On the inside, the captain, something. Uh, this chapter will remain unknown until you leave the ship and return the book to me. How am I returning the book to you? If you're dead. No! <laughs> no! Okay, wait, actually, can I just... Perfect. Perfect! Okay. Captain, mate, bosun, gunner, purser, surgeon, carpenter, steward, midshipman, topman, seaman, rigging, rigging! The network of ropes and chains supporting the mass and used for working the sails. That's what that means. There's a death card. Tab, open and close the book. Ha! Ah, Q table, eh, whatever. He's not dead at this point. I assumed he was. I really assumed he was. Dark Hunter, welcome and hello, how are you doing? Hope you're having a good day, welcome! This game is from the creator of Papers, Please. I haven't played Papers, Please, by the way. I have never, I have never played that one. Uh, you're gonna find out? I'm assuming, I really hope. I hope I'm gonna find everything out. Supposedly Formosa is how Taiwan used to be called or some country in that area. Yeah, it is a country. It is an actual country. I just got... Okay, so there's a cage that is kind of broken. That's one detail that I'm noticing. Look at me noticing details. Aha! Detail noted. Noted! Can I use any of these? I really want to interact with stuff, but I don't think that's the point of the game. I Okay, this is something with the body, right? Two royalty and two guards. That sounds like little guards, right? That sounds like there should be more guards for the royalty. Doesn't it? Reading. <laughs> right? But, but unfortunately, there wasn't too much to read. That's not how you hang out someone. Those pirates are dumb. How? Th why do you have a lot of experience in how you hang people, Leo? Why, why do you have experience in that specific skill. Boy, it's a good thing it made you read all that important information first. You might have wandered around for hours without a clue otherwise. Yeah, right? All of those important... On the cargo deck! Dramatic. Captain! Open the door! Kick it in. Ah! Lest we break it down and take more than those shells! You bastards may taste exactly what I give you! Okay. Captain, open the door. So, am I supposed to understand that this guy is the captain? Because he was the one in control of the situation and opened the door later on. Okay, there's nothing here. Uh, sir, 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 mister, I, okay, fine. He shoots and kills this guy. This guy, we have to assume, is the body that we find on the floor. The guy with an axe. Oh, oh I could walk past him. Yee! Are we going to have any more information here? Probably not. Okay, so... No! 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 
Okay, he got shot to the neck. I granted that was a good way of showing you the mechanics. Good, good, good. However, why are you sending me to the end? What? Huh? I want you guys to know I am not doing this. <laughs> this is just happening. Who is this? How did they die? Captain. Okay. This unknown soul met an unknown fate. We just saw what happened. He got shot in the neck. Memories where this person appears can be navigated from here. Ooh! First memory. Perish in... Bookmark all memories where they appear for quicker navigation. I don't think I understand how that works. But that's okay! That's alright! Use these buttons at the top of the page to edit bookmarks and navigate between them. Oh god, I'm gonna actually have to learn this mechanics, won't I? I'm gonna actually have to learn this mechanics. This unknown soul meant an unknown fate. Aha! Well, 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 well. Memory. Perished in the end part one. Show memories on deck, Mac. Depicted injustice at sea sketch. It's giving me quite a bit of information. I'm starting to think I didn't need to write down anything on a notepad. I'm starting to think maybe that was overprepared. Maybe I was overpreparing. Ellie anyway, noticing details. Is that not illegal? You would think. You would think. But I am going to show you all. I'm going to show you all that I can. Maybe. Hopefully. <laughs> Hopefully! This stream is from the creator of Worms. What? I, I still haven't played Worms. Because, yes, okay, remind me not to get on your bad side, Lil. Uh, that man certainly has a captain's mustache. I love the voice acting. The voice acting is really good. Uh, this seems like a very, very big brain game. I want to play it very badly now. Go ahead! I'm probably not gonna get very far because I'm, like... My brain is... On the slow side, let's just say it that way. <laughs> let's just let's just say it that way. Um, it's a very good puzzle game. I'm I'm starting to feel that way, but also I trust it because so many people talk about this game with so much praise. Like I don't doubt it. Taking notes is unnecessary. The book has everything. Okay, <laughs> I over prepared. Um, I would love that at the end of this game, Ellie sends everyone to jail, but not the murderer. I get to send people to jail? I thought everyone was dead! Okay, so, first memory perished in the end. Show memories on like map. The big dead just to see. I wanna see how it shows me the memories. If I click on it, do I see it again? Captain, open the door, kick it in. Let's we break it down and take more than those shells. You bastard. May I take exactly what I give you. This, the X marks who's speaking, I assume, right? Okay. Location of the corpse. Is there perfect? Oh, this is what the looking glass is for. And then others were present. Uh, it's this guy though, right? It's this guy, not that guy. Pretty sure. Is it showing like? Is it showing me that this guy is the same as that guy? Cause they it, the photos are way too low quality. Like, the photos are way too low quality. But this guy is here. Like, is here with this guy. And that guy is... This guy, I assume? So... Miss an unknown fate. Not true. He was... Shot. By a gun. By the... Captain. For now! For now, that's what we know. Maybe that's not right. But for now, that's what seems to have happened. Okay, wait, I get to see it again! Okay, yeah, that is the guy with the little weird hat. That is the guy with the weird hat. Trying to memorize his face, although it doesn't matter because most of the... Wait. Is that on the shoulder? No, that is in the base of the neck. That That is on the base of the neck. So this has to be the one that kills him. It's really hard to see our face. 
And I really have to assume that this guy is the captain. He has a mustache. Maybe a goatee as well. Maybe a goatee as well. So yeah, it is the captain. It is the captain. Wait, was that second in command? He's very close to the captain and he's wearing an important hat. Was he a second in command or something? Okay, how do I get out of here now? How do I how do I go back to the present time? How do I how do I Ooh, you can zoom in. <gasps> oh hell yeah! Wait, 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 hell yeah! Oh, this is gonna help a lot. This is gonna help a lot. Cause my My ability to identify them isn't all that great. Are you the captain? Yes, you are. I got that one right. That's that's fine. You! I hadn't even noticed you before. Who are you? I can't see you. Wait, 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 wait. There are other stairs. People highlighted were present in the scene. Yeah, I had missed this guy, but then the, the pictures told me that there was a third person. You are the guy there in the back. You have a little bit of a beard, don't you? He has a little bit of a beard. And he's holding a knife. Why is he holding a knife? Why are you holding a knife? Were you gonna cut a rope or were you gonna cut a person? All important information. All important details to remember, folks. I'm assuming this is how I get out. Ellie's selling herself short as usual. I just, I just rather not disappoint. <laughs> I think it took me about 15 hours to solve everything. Well, folks, now you get it. Now you know it. It's gonna take us 30 hours to solve everything. Always assume that I'm gonna take twice as much as a competent person. Always assume it's gonna take me twice as much. Okay. Buckets. Buckets. We have... This room looks exactly the same it did in the memory. Now. Somebody perished here. I think, based on that little hat, that it was the other guy in that memory. Oh, and there's another one here. Look, here's the thing. How is the guy alive? How is the guy alive? Considering that these people are bones. So, it's been a long enough time that they completely decomposed. How is the other guy alive? If the, the ship has barely now returned. If the ship is only now returning, how is it that they are all decomposed and everything? Can I grab stuff anywhere? No? Okay. So, first this guy. First this guy. Fer fer first this guy. Um, Why would Ellie condemn herself? I believe in your ability to brute force it. <laughs> Thank you. It's not quality because you don't know who they are yet. I see. Is he gonna get better quality as it goes? People highlighted were present in the scene. I'm about a half hour behind on double speed, so I can't help at all right now. Don't worry about it. We still have no information. So running a shot squarely placed in the neck is in fact not a skill issue. Yeah, if it had been the shoulder. Imagine naming your kid guy with a little weird. <laughs> Hey, check the captain's cabin to see what happened. Yeah, 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 we're here, we're here. I'm pretty sure this is the captain's well, cabin, right? Must be in here someplace. <laughs> They're at the bottom of the sea. That's a lie. So they, they roughed him up. They roughed the captain up. They are roughing the captain up. And then... This is still the captain, because he has a mustache and a goatee. This is still the captain. The captain manages to fend off a guy with a little heart and slice his throat open. So the captain, the captain killed this one. I don't know his name. I don't know anyone's name, but I'm pretty sure, right? The gun's there on the floor. So he got roughed up enough to drop the gun. Let's see if there's anything on the other side. Aha! Somebody was coming in from the back. 
Okay, so this guy probably killed the captain. Came in here and took him from behind, right? Right? I'm deducing stuff. I am deducing stuff. My brain is powerful today. My brain is, my, my brain is going to be very powerful today. Okay? Believe it. Um... The captain was throwing hands and slinging bullets, so it's obvious to check on him next. Yes, but I think, I think, the captain got taken out from the back by that guy that had the knife that was, like, climbing down the, the balcony. Yeah, yeah, the rats eat their meat? I don't know. Oh, I guess that would speed up the rate at which the, the corpses become skeletons, right? So maybe it hasn't been that, 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 that long. But they had external help, like rats eating their meat. Hmm. Ellie will brute smart her way through this mystery. I will discover it with my brain. Have a little bit of faith. Only a little bit. Okay, you were not entirely decapitated. Killed, knifed, eaten. Ugh. Oh, God. Poison, shot, speared, spiked, strangled, struck, suicide, torn apart. Okay. So you were knifed in the throat. That's the best, the, the, the one that fits the best, right? A live axe burn, clawed, club, crushed, decapitated. It wasn't decapitated because the the head didn't roll off the body. In electrocuter exploded. Yeah, knifed. Knifed. Knifed by the captain. Yes. Where are they? They mustn't be in here somewhere. They're at the bottom of the sea, that's a lie. They were looking for the shells, quote unquote. Whatever the shells are, they were that important and valuable that people were willing to kill for them. Okay, others were present. Yeah, we have you, the captain, and believe it or not, the guy with the knife. Believe it or not, I noticed them before the book told me this time. The captain killed everyone, clearly. I don't think the captain killed everyone. I do think the captain got assaulted by a bunch of people. Oh, I got better at controlling this. Look, look. I'm getting better. I'm getting better. Okay, guy with the little hat. There. There we go. There we go. Okay, and you... So I propose, you have a little beard, etc. I propose that as soon as I get out of this memory and I go there, I go back there and I check on... Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, cool. And I, I check on the, on the other corpse. It's going to be the captains. It's going to be the captains. Let's see if I'm right, but... I... I'm gonna have to find the key! I'm gonna have to find the key! But he's gonna have it because he's the captain! Right? Right? That's not roughing him up. They were trying to rough him up. I always uh, give people I couldn't work out nicknames like Beanie Guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah! He, the, that guy is the guy with a little weird hat. <laughs> um, fun fact, the famous pirate accent comes from Bristol. That is interesting. Uh, worst mutinies ever. Well, they succeeded in killing the captain, so I don't know that was, that was the worst mutiny. Uh, they, they did achieve the goal. Well, actually, their goal was to get to the shell, so maybe they did, maybe they didn't. I guess we have to figure it out. Those were black powder gun times. They were useless after firing once, unless you had like 10 seconds to reload it. Ah! So he threw it to the ground and switched to his knife. Because there wasn't any point in using it again. Oh, surely. Wait a second. There's a spear on the floor. There's a knife on the floor. There's another knife on the floor. But the gun is nowhere to be found. Isn't that interesting? Hmm. That's a shoe. That's another shoe. Yeah. The gun isn't here, guys. Isn't that interesting? Hmm. I happen to know that no ship could be insured without at least one cat on board. Best rat defense. Maybe the, da the cat died first. I know that it's sad to think about it, but maybe. Uh, seagulls would eat them too? Okay, so maybe it was seagulls. But seagulls would also, like, fly from the cat. So maybe the cat died first. 
Seagulls will roll a six and kill them as well. I don't think too much about this comment. Don't worry, I'm not thinking at all. <laughs> I have a mystery to think about. There was a mutiny for an unknown reason. Beanie, knifey, and shot dead. The famous sailors of England. Oh! Oh! Okay! So, all of my predictions were kind of wrong. Because that's Beanie Guy, right? That's Beanie Guy. The captain got shanked and then managed to, like, beat the other guy up. It doesn't seem like a death blow, though. But also, that's not the same shirt that this guy was using. So, this guy... This guy really is that guy? Are the photos so low quality that I struggle to see, like, similarities? I really think the beer matches. The beer matches. This could be the same guy that was climbing down based on the face. But the clothes don't match. The body type doesn't match. I don't think. But damn, this captain, this captain was, uh, really freaking strong, huh? Flamelock pistols didn't have a 10 second reload. They had at their fastest, like, a 45 second reload? Holy shit! Holy shit! Okay, so that is the same guy. That is supposed to be the same guy. Three memories. Do you have... Do you have... Do you have this, this, this memory of him? So that's Beanie Guy, Captain, and him. So he has to be the one that was coming down the, the balcony. Weird. Weird. Okay. So I, unfortunately, I don't have anything for this guy because I don't think he died here. I really don't think he died here. He got what? He got like hit in the head with the side of a stick of a spear. That's not enough to die. That is definitely not enough to die. One other person present, you and the captain who you were trying to kill. That tracks. Location of the corpse, memory, etc. All of that tracks. I am not going to put anything down for him because I genuinely don't think that he died from that i genuinely don't believe it what happened in here there's a woman in the bed maybe ill maybe just sleeping but i don't think she would be just sleeping maybe she's dead maybe she's ill maybe she's dead maybe this is a corpse already maybe it isn't we don't have enough info we don't have enough info. Captain got shanked, then he defended himself with a gentle tap to the forehead. There is blood, don't get me wrong, there is blood, but like, I still don't think that's enough. I still don't think that's enough. Looks like she has a cut in the head. Wait, 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 wait. Yeah, that could be a cut. There could be a cut in the forehead. Okay, who are you? You are a random woman. Doesn't seem like you are connected to anyone in particular. Open the book while examining a place to flip directly to the sketch. Yeah, good, thank you. It's that woman. Yeah, thank you. You can, you can stop now. Okay, it's this woman who was just dancing along with everyone else. There's nothing important. There's nothing important there so far. For now. Do we think she's dead? If she's dead, why would she be covered? I don't think she's dead. I think she's probably sick and recovering. She's not sleeping because she would have woken up with the rockers of the fights. But she's not dead because she wouldn't be covered up. Or at least she would be covered up up until her entire head included. So she's probably recovering from something. That's my verdict. Is it royalty? No, 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 it, it isn't. It isn't. Gentle top. I mean, there's blood, sure. But it doesn't seem like a 
enough to kill someone. Am I the only one crazy to think that? Wait! Were they trying to lower something? That cage wasn't in there when I came in. Maybe, maybe it's completely irrelevant details, but... I, I'm gonna check it, I'm gonna keep it in mind, I'm gonna keep it in mind. He became captain by orc rules. He just killed everyone. The door is locked in your timeline. Examine the woman! I'm trying. Ha! Ah, okay, so it doesn't have to do with finding a key. As long as you open it in the past, you get to keep it open in the present. Okay, so... Woman is definitely dead now, for sure, for sure. You have to be the captain, right? Have to be the captain. That is the pistol. Okay, so I'm I'm going to go in, out, out of the limb and guess something. What is that sparkle thing? What is that sparkle thing? Man, this captain is a big boy to fight three dudes off like this. Exactly. Psych! Well, I'm, I'm doing my best. I'm doing my best to predict stuff. Clues are a distraction from justice. Detective Nikos. Did I say that? <laughs> Did I say that? He's the only one who had a knife outside of the captain. Cool, the knife guy? Yeah. The color of your shirt threw me off. Um, the man's face escaped in. That's not a gentle top. It wasn't enough. It wasn't enough to kill. So here's my prediction. Woman died. And she was the captain's wife or lover or something. He locked himself in here until she died. And then when she died, he took the pistol and he went out of the world by himself. That's my guess right now. And this thing... Uh, I do think you're being crazy. Abigail. When Your am I not? Brother. My friend. I shot him. Dead. I'll be with you. Soon. Reloading. Please forgive me for everything. Okay, so I was right. Look at me. Look at me actually deducing stuff. Abigail is dead by now, so that I was wrong. I was wrong in that. I was wrong in that. She's Abigail. He offs himself. Once everyone else has been offed already. Okay. I mean... Okay, he's dead. Fine. Fine, he's dead. He was killed by a gentle tap in the forehead, I guess. And then, um... He offs himself out of the guilt of killing this guy. This guy was the brother of Abigail. But he didn't say a name. He said, your brother, my friend. So... That doesn't really give us a name, but we have a name, Abigail. We're starting with Abigail. Trigger warning from the next thing. Thank you so much for warning people because you knew what was happening and I didn't until way too late. Well, not until way too late, but thank you for warning people. Um, Ellie thinks everyone's head is as durable as hers. I just, I just don't think he would have died from that. Okay, who is this? This unknown soul is not an unknown soul. This person's face is no longer blurred, which means that they can now be identified. Use the book and pocket watch to gather enough information to deduce their identity. Revisit memories on the ship using the pocket watch to study relationships, appearances, and activities. Use the book map, uh, Maps, Crew Manifest, and Artist Sketches along with the individual conversation logs to find clues about names, relationships, appearances, and roles. There were 60 people on the ship when it left England. We're under 51! Determining everyone's identity and fate will not be easy. Wait, 50, 52? The size of information is rare. You will have to make assumptions using partial information. 
Some identities may only be revealed through process of elimination. Good luck! Wait, so uh, didn't they say that it was the captain and 51 people? A 51 crew? That's the moon or the sun? No, it's not. It's inside of the water sometimes. Um, Her head wasn't covered. Maybe she's just sick. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. But according to the scene that we just watched, I definitely think that she was dead by then. Um, you see in the future? I'm sure. I'm sure I'll discover a lot. Chad, Chad of 10. The Chad of 10. Ellie staring at a skeleton. Okay, so I predict she died. <laughs> it wasn't a skeleton when I predicted. It wasn't. Selvi, did I say hello to you today? Welcome. Hi, how are you doing? Hope you're having a good day. The man with a broken heart shot himself in the heart. So that's so sad. Yeah, it kind of is. Were you right? <laughs> kind of. The woman was already dead. She wasn't sick or recovering. But for everything else, I was kind of right. Such upbeat music for a room full of dead guys that are frozen, self unalive and alivening. The, I don't notice the music. Can I be honest? The minute that there's silence, I forget that it was that at, at any point there was music. <laughs> I agree he would get nowhere near enough force from backward swings to insta-kill someone, but eh. Okay, thank you for agreeing with me. We'll, we'll go with what the game says, but come on, come on. Even if it was not a killing blow, I'm not exactly sure what your thought process of the next part of the story be. He shanked the captain, captain kept his head in, and then they went, nice day, mate, let's do this again sometime. <laughs> I just think he could have been kept fighting. Am I the only one who thinks that I could that he could have kept fighting after that hit in the head? Okay, that was suicide from gun. This may or may not be correct. No, it is correct. Shut up, book. I am right, book. Fates are validated in sets of three. Correctly identify at least three people and their fate to have the information typeset into the book. What does that mean though? Will it confirm it even if it's wrong? What if I have wrong information and I say, hey, this guy's died this way. And then I, I combine three of them. Will the game go, yep, you're right. Here it is. It's correct information, even if it's not. Um, 51 crew members plus passengers. Ah, she was a skeleton when you said that. Okay, but you know what I mean. You have said hello to me. Thanks. Okay, just in case, just in case. I think there was a mutant rap with the power of controlling people's minds, but that's just my theory. Y you are probably the most correct of us all. <laughs> You're probably the only one who's right. Not enough to kill someone, she says, looking at the scene tied to his corpse. I'm just saying, I think if I was hit on the head in the middle of a battle to the death, the adrenaline would keep me going. I personally think, like, he ripped to him, but I personally think my adrenaline would keep me alive after that. Sounded like the Sims shopping music. I, I can't remember. The book judges you. The book is dumb. Abigail, your brother, my friend, I shot him dead. I'll be with you soon. My love, forgive me for everything. Yeah, there is no name in there other than Abigail. So let's go to the book. Can I get... Okay, four memories. So, no, I don't, I don't care about the memories. I just want to see him in the book. So I'm going to go now. I'm going to go. Bye-bye. Uh, uh, bye bye. It's a very opinionated book. It's 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 giving me false information. May or may not be right. Oh please, please. What's that mean? What's that mean? The the end. Oh, this is like the very last fate. By this point, like, he was probably the last to die in the entire list of deaths, huh? So what this is saying is that 
way before there had already been a bunch of stuff happening. Doesn't it? Isn't that what it's saying? Okay, we're gonna go to the... the... the sketches. We're gonna go here. And we're gonna say this is Abigail. Ab... Abigail! Passenger... Sure. There we go. Abigail, the wife of the captain. Wife of the captain. And they just mark him off as crushed by the captain already. Yeah, 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 sorry, I forgot, I forgot. You. You. Where? Clubbed? Crushed? Beast cannon cargo rigging stones. No, that's clubbed. I guess. Clubbed. Eaten out to get your. How does that cover the. No, it's a definitely. It, it would be clubbed, I think. Clubbed by the captain. There we go. I think that's all the info we have. I think that's all the info we have. I think for now that's that's where we're at. I think that's where we're at. And I think we can probably see Abigail's fate. Right? Um it's if there's a uh, three right identifications, it will perma print the ones that are right. Oh, only the ones that are right then. Good, 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 good. From what I understand, the game will let you progress as long as you get three right, and it might just cause you trouble later on. But if they're right, at least we know that those are right. Ellie, just mark him off as crushed by the captain already. Yeah, for most of royalty would not be the crew. Good point. Good point. The royalty will never be crew. Right. Though now we know that the man that was shot was Abigail's brother. So if we find out who Abigail's brother is, we know who the captain shot. Yeah. Uh, game developers seem to love using Abigail for passed away characters. It's a nice name. Four people died in this chapter. Yeah, we're only missing her. We have the captain, the knife guy, the beanie guy, and the... Brother of Abigail. There we go. Sorry, I had a brain fart right there. <laughs> For a moment, everything stopped. So, oh, so the four X's are the four deaths. So Abigail died in the previous chapter. That's what's happening. Oh, that means his brother was also a literal. Not really, because... Wait. You are Abigail who sought Witcherell. But she's called Witcherell because she's married to Robert Witcherell. Because they were lovers. But if she was Abigail who sought Witcherell, that would mean maybe there is a who sought. Who sought? William who sought, first mate from Scotland. Just like Abigail. So I think... I think... This guy... Is... Is... This guy. William Hussard, shot by a gun... By Captain Robert Whittle. Whitterell. Yeah. I'm gonna write that down. I'm pretty sure that's right. I'm pretty sure that's right. Thank you. Thank you for making me... Thank you for making me notice that. William Hoscott. Hoscott. Hoscott? Have I been saying it wrong the entire time? Hoscott. Instead of Hussot? I like Hussot more. <laughs> she took a double name. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, Marcin Janoska, welcome and hello. How are you doing? Hope you're having a good day. This is the first time I see you here. So welcome, welcome. Welcome to the channel. Welcome to the pit. Hi. Um... Now he will have to change the mating order. What do you mean the mating order? Scottish people be like hard, uh, like hard sea noises. Hos, hor, hos, hos, Scott. She looks very happy now, though. 
What the skeleton? The skeleton does have a silly grin. The, the skeleton has a pretty silly grin on its face. Okay, so this should show us before everything else, right? Sounds like a storm. Sounds like a storm. Oh, shit! Yeah, it was a storm. It was not a storm, it was a freaking Kraken! What the hell? Holy shit! There's a Kraken? Oh, can I go up? I want to see more. I want to see as much as I can. No! No! I want to see the Kraken! I want to see... Let me see the Kraken! Okay, I guess I don't get to see the Kraken. Damn it. Okay, fine. 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 <gasps> um... Well, rip to you! <laughs> Storm lo No, wait! Wait! <laughs> right, I had to check on Abigail! I got distracted! I got distracted! There was so much going on! There was so much going on, I forgot there was a time limit! Not sick, badly hurt. Yep, it was not a sickness. It was... It was kind of her own fault. She shouldn't have been outside when a Kraken was a tugger, you know what I mean? The corpse was moved post-mortem. She didn't meet an unknown fate. She was crushed by Ricking? Is that is that how it's counted? Decapitated, drowned, clawed, electrocuted, expired, exploded, fell, froze, illness, killed, knives, uh, poison, shot, spear, spike, strangled, struck, suicide, struck? No. Okay, so it has to be. Uh, Crushed by wrecking. Well done! Three fates correct! Yay! Yay me! Congratulations, Ellie, for doing the tutorial. <laughs> Congratulations, Brain, for like figuring out the most basic of basic levels of a game. What's that mean? What are the three lines there? Ellie simping for the Kraken? No, I'm not. I'm not simping for the Kraken. Okay. The the phone in the suit the I have to I have to hurry. Okay, that's Abigail. Cool. Uh the the clock is vibrating, so I'm really scared of it going away. And like Space action. What do you mean action? What do you mean action? Wait, wait, wait. Speared uh thing, you spear that guy. I wanna I wanna know who this guy is. He has tattoos. You are the one who died later on. Uh who else? Who else who else who else who else? You. Who are you? Uh that guy. Okay, cool. Who are you? Uh passenger, I assume, because you seem Ooh. Ooh. She, he seemed very ill prepared. You also very ill prepared. No, there was a child! Oh, poor child! Oh, child, you should not have been here. You should not have been here. Did we do it already? Yes? Who are you? You're not the guy who was... Yeah, there it is, there it is. Okay. So, so, action, action, action. I'm gonna take an action to... With the guy who's cutting half. Because that's the one that I'm most curious about. Um, she's only a scratch. Yeah, this this is nothing. This is please. Well, this one unexpected places. I was not expecting it. Some of the deaths in this game are really grody. Uh, gory. I mean, uh, I assume you mean, but I understand not wanting to write it down because words. Uh, he's half the money he used to be. <laughs> no, <laughs> rest in pieces. Um. 
he'll get better, I'm sure. I'm sure. Just a little week, uh, a week in bed, a little bandaid, rigging, cause it'd be the mass, which is part of the rigging. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hooves never trust him. I guess there's gonna be a horse at some point or a cow. Honestly, at this point, I have to expect anything. There's a freaking kraken. Cause of death, krakened. We got three fates correct. That was the first made with Abigail. It was. Okay, tattoos guy, action. What is the action? What am I doing? What is an action? What is it for? Huh? Okay. Okay. All right. What is this? What is this? It's bringing the corpse to this area and time so that I can do something with it. Cool! Grody adjective, disgusting, revolting. Oh! I didn't know that word. Thank you! I think he called that dude by name. Yeah, he called someone Martin. My problem is, I don't know who, who Martin is. If it's the, the person right there next to her when she dies. That's the thing that I would assume, but that is an assumption. That's the man who shanked the captain. Yeah, the, the man who died later on. I bet the captain blobbed the Kraken to death too. I wouldn't be surprised, honestly. He was, he was. You're a child in here. What do you mean I'm a child in here? I'm not a child. She's the child. I don't think it was a child, just a short woman. You think... Well... I guess we should have expected that. We, we should have known. We should have known that the reason he's dead is because of the Kraken. He did try though, look! Sword, he did try. That was good for him. Look, they even cut one of the tentacles off. Good for them. Honestly, you guys were trying your best. You guys were trying your best. What's this? You are dead. I have to assume by Kraken. I have to. Doesn't really matter. <gasps> An animal! An animal! We have found what the gauges were for and probably the origin of the hoofs that are gonna kill some people. You. Okay, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Who are you? Well, doesn't matter. Are you being guided to his body? Apparently. Apparently. The Doom! The Doom is what they were calling the Kraken. Martin is probably the one whose sketch went clear after the scene. I don't see the sketches as being clear. Can I be honest? I don't see the sketches as being clear at all. They are all very, um... Very... It's grimy for me. Was torn apart by a beast. It's a beast. Technically, it's a monster, but you know what? Beast is the best we got so far. Others were present. So many others. So, so many others. Abigail was present too. Well, not at this point in time, I guess. He was completely dead by then. Very dead. Oh, look! One of the guards was there. Wonder if he was any useful. Probably not. Probably not. Oh, were they using animal cages as bait for the Kraken? I hope not. I hope they weren't, like, trying to use the animals as bait. I'm assuming they would have taken the animals to eat themselves. That's how you find out scurvy, by having fresh, fresh, um, sources of nutrients. Did you know? How about you? How about you? What the frick is going on? What? What? Okay, it's guiding me towards this. Okay, so it only can be, it can only be corpses, huh? If this guy was alive at this point in time, it's not really useful to me. So I need to follow the corpses trail. 
got it. Got it, got it, got it. I'm still learning. I'm still learning. Um... What's she coming up with the first maid with the list of 60 names we got? Maybe we can look up Martin too. Maybe, maybe he was, maybe she wasn't. I'm not sure I'd use the phrase good for him looking at literal moment of him being ripped in him. <laughs> I mean, good for him for actually like trying to fight back and getting some damage in. That's, that's what I mean. Good for him for not going down quietly, you know? But where are you going? I mean, I mean, good for fighting back. Dying to a goat kind of embarrassing, not gonna lie. I wonder who, I wonder who died to the goat. Uh, beast and monster can both mean really dangerous animal. Yeah. That's why the only one that fits is beast. It has to be beast. Fruit prevents scurvy, not meat. Any... Any sources of fresh uh, nutrients actually help with scurvy. The problem is that when they when they traveled in these long trips, normally they didn't have any fresh meat or any fresh vegetables or anything like that. Okay, they threw. I'm assuming that's, like, an explosive. It has to be an explosive. That's a person? Wait, I can't see it well enough. Is that a person? Is that our, our person who dies here? Ooh, you are not gonna have a nice night after this. I can't see it well enough. Is that a body, a human body? In the middle of that. This is the hardest one so far. Because I can't exactly tell what I'm looking at. Um, basically, what you need is... Uh, for To fend off scurvy, what you need is vitamin C. And vitamin C is present in... Uh, obviously, in juice and citrix and everything. Very, very strongly, very concentrated. But you also have vitamin C in fresh vegetables, fresh meat, fresh uh, fruit of any kind. The problem with the trips that they used to take was... The problem with the, the meat that they used to take and the vegetables and everything is that everything was cooked and dried and everything so that it could like keep well without rotting for months and months and months. Throw the powder, and then they shot the powder or something? Just the powder won't explode. They have to actually, like, properly make it explode, trigger it, if you want an explosion of that caliber. Okay, so the man who's there is not the man who was speaking. So that guy isn't the one who was suggesting the powder. Regardless, it was powder. Now, I could say that this guy died by explosion, but he might have been dead already by the Kraken. The explosion couldn't be not the thing that killed it. You know what I mean? Scenes happened at the exact moment that someone died. Yeah, so I need corpses. I need corpses. Um... All tentacle lovers looking at the tat man like, wish that was me. The no, nobody should <laughs> wish that. I imagine quietly was certainly not how he went. Exactly. I'm sure he wasn't quiet when it happened. I mean, I mean fighting back guys. Hard to go down quietly when you're being ripped in half. Don't be so literal. They shot the powder while he was holding on to it. I'm assuming they have to trigger it somehow. It's vitamin C you need, ascorbic acid. The name literally means without scurvy. I know, but vitamin C is present in a lot of sources. I'm telling you this because I do not eat citrix. I hate citrix. Any citric I despise, and I don't have scurvy, because you get vitamin C from fresh fruit, fresh meat, fresh vegetables, and everything else. That is a dead man you just saw, yeah. I know, but I can't know if it died from the explosion or from the, the kraken. 
Put that one down from exploded, I think. I, I think so too, but I'm still scared of making assumptions. I know that I'm gonna have to. I know that I'm gonna have to. I kinda don't want to yet. You probably fell to your death. You probably... Well, not necessarily to his death. If you really think about it. I can't wait until that goat kills someone. I can't wait. I can't wait. I want to know who died from goat. I want to know if you died from this. Because that sounds like you would, like... Quickly... Take you to death. Wait, so... What else can I do here? I can't use this as a jumping pad to go to any other pasts because there are no other corpses. There were no other corpses. So... Oh, but I can go down here! Maybe there are corpses down here. Yes, there are! Nice, okay. Okay, so... We are gonna have at least one person crushed by a cannon, at the very least. Because that's on the list of things. Aha! What else? What else do we have? We have... This... Probably the Kraken. Probably the Kraken. What else? What else? What else? Is this like holding cells or something? Not really. No, this is just the day. This is the rooms. The rooms of people. And then what do we have here? Nothing. No bodies, no corpses, no anything. Okay. Okay, we're gonna go for that one. Corpses here, corpses there. There are corpses everywhere. And that's what we need. That's what we need. Yep. You, poor soul, were crushed to death by a cannon. What is that? Is that a person? That's a person! Wait, were you the one crushed by a cannon? Wait, this is... This is... This is confusing. <laughs> this is really confusing to me! Well, there's nothing there. Uh-oh. I've talked too well about my brain today. I can't get confused this early and this easily. I, I, I refuse. I refuse. Okay, so that guy was crushed by a cannon. For sure, for sure. But... Ooh! That's the moment he breaks? No, it's not. Um... I'm curious with Abigail's relation to Martin, to the point where she braved the Kraken battle for him. Why was his profession on the list of people? She wasn't... She wasn't looking for Martin because of Martin. She was looking for Martin to ask Martin where her husband was. To be fair, I doubt someone would yell at a dead man to throw the barrel. I don't know, Scurvy would explain a few things from past streams. I... No orange, lemons, limes, grapefruit, sanguinello. I hate all of those. I hate them so much. Throw a coin and let orange Jesus decide the dead way. Ah, I don't think so. I don't think so. I don't think so. What's happened here? What's happened here is you got crushed by a cannon, buddy. You got crushed by a cannon. Uh, crushed by a cannon. Good, we're making very slow progress. <laughs> okay, so that... How did I not see this guy before? That guy exploded, man. I know there's one person there. But there's... They're not allowing me to go for it. So this guy who exploded... Um, at least it's someone exploding. I don't know. I don't think that killed him. I'm just saying that the Kraken could have killed it. The Kraken could have killed him instead of the 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 explosion. Hey, hey, why where are you going? Where are you going?
Okay, cool, we're right here. The scurvy is rough. Make sure healing slow down, even opens old wounds. I know. Ooh, ooh. Exploding on that guy, right? Right? Yeah? I think Skeleton crushed by a cannon is a good candidate of who was crushed by a cannon. But it, it didn't seem to be. It didn't seem. This guy might have been crushed by a cannon too. Now let's find the wrong storage. That would be. You'll see later. But I need to figure some stuff out. Ellie was free stream on the man exploding from an exploding barrel. This? That's what that's what it is. That's what it is. This guy. Uh, fun fact: There's an achievement called Captain Did It for getting all deaths false by marking them as killed by a captain. Has to be false death though, so wrong method at least. That's funny. I'll get it. I'll get that one. That sounds very easy to do. That sounds very. Oh, so two of them died here. Two of them died. One of them... One of them... By crushing, and the other one... By exploding of the cannon. Wait, wait. So this guy and this guy both died at the same time, right? Right? Because that's a guy. That's a guy down there. I can't exactly know who it is, but I know that there's a guy down there. Oh, look, Tattoo Guy was still alive! Am I going to get unreasonably attached to people just because they're very easy to recognize? Maybe. Okay, so the, the, the hat is here, which leads me to believe this is Hat Guy. And this guy is the other one, the bald, the bald guy. Oh god, she's already getting confused between chat messages. I'm just, yeah, yeah. Any doubts about this one? Yes. To the surprise of no one! I'm kind of confused about that one too. Um, upstairs man got boom boom to death. Okay, I'll believe you guys. It's going to be boom boom to death. Oh, because you guys are saying that the snapshot of the moment where he dies is what we followed. And the snapshot of the moment was with the explosion of full swing. Therefore, it has to have been the explosion and not the Kraken beforehand. Okay. Seeing their attempt of mutiny, I can believe the captain could take all of them. Um, plus, they were all already weakened by the Kraken. Top hat guy, yeah. Yeah, this guy is the owner of the hat. So, we are going to go to the book. You got exploded. I think that's the most... Live experiment called Club Crush Decapitated Drowned. Engine electrocuter expired, exploded, fell, froze, illness, killed, knifed, shot, poison, spear, spiked, strangle. I guess it could be shot by a cannon. But it wasn't by an unknown attacker. It was it was a a mistake, a fuse. So maybe it has to be exploded. Because it was busted by a cannon by mistake. You were crushed by a cannon. Who else? Who else? Okay. Oh, now you show me this guy. Now you show me this. He was, he was crushed by a cannon. Shot has a prefix, cannon. Yeah, it was that. It was that indeed. It was that indeed. Okay. Okay, there you are. Let me let me 
Look at that corpse. Wrong? I'm wrong? Okay, so it was a Kraken tentacle. It was a Kraken tentacle. But this is this is where the top hat guy dies. What happened to the other one? Top hat guy. Which I'm assuming you are. Yeah. You get shot by the cannon. Horribly. You! What happens to you? What happens to that guy? You! I guess he got crushed by a beast instead of the cannon? Honestly, Tattoo Man was my favorite design. He has a very strong design, yeah. And this is why some of us expressed an interest in seeing what would happen if we threw you at mist. I still don't know what, it, what mist is. I know only legends of how tricky Miss can get. Me, I don't know anything about it. Who is this? How did they die? Okay, so this is... Hmm. Plot twist. The captain is a were-cracking. <gasps> he killed everyone. Top Hat guy makes me think of Henry Stickman more than anything else. And th this is definitely not Henry Stickman. For sure, for sure. It was a Kraken. He grabbed the cannon, uttered a witty one-liner, and blew him away. Can you imagine? Gotta find who lit the fuse. So, whoever lit the fuse is gonna be counted as the murderer, even if they weren't actually trying to murder him? It wasn't me, it was a ten-armed man! Surely not, surely not me. Load, move my hands, aim level, ready, no, pull a spark! Police! Oh! The guy who died! Top hat guy! Top hat guy was like, No way! Don't turn it on yet! I'm on the other side of this shit! And then he died anyway. Who is this? How did they die? Crushed... By a beast. Right? Because that was the moment of his death. And his death is like there, crushed against the cannon. Well, it could be crushed against, the, like, by a cannon as well. Could be crushed by a cannon. A lot of these are not clearing up, guys. I think a lot of this is not working on my favor. I think a lot of this is not working great for me. This guy. Where did you end up? Tattoo man. This guy. Ooh! What's going on with you? Oh, you're holding the cannon. Good for you. You 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 worked very well. You were a good uh good crewmate. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. Gotta find who lit the fuse. Crushed by a goat. We're still waiting on that goat. Okay, wait. We are going to go. We are going to go. Life at sea. We are going to go. Oh, I would have to remember who that was, actually. And I don't think I care to remember who that was. So, instead, we are going to go to the memories. Is there a way to go to the memories? The crew, the ship... Uh, the doom. Let's check here. We have you. 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 Who was exploded. She exploded. There we go. You were exploded. You were crushed by cannon. You were... I wish I could see the memories again. Like, properly... Ex like, properly... Um...
probably explore them, you know? Um, is this game really made by the same crew that made Papers, Please? I don't know. I assume so. It was not by a loose cannon, I'd say. But I didn't, I didn't write down that it was a loose cannon. I just didn't write, write down anything, you know? I didn't necessarily write that it was, uh, uh, loose cannon. What is going on? Oh, I am getting to replay a memory. You can, you can just go back to the body. Hell yeah, okay. So we know, we know that this guy was shot, but who lit the fuse? Who lit the fuse was... You? You! You lit the fuse! Cause your thing is on fire! You, buddy! Lit the fuse! And you are the one who killed, who shanked the captain later on. So I'm gonna write that down. I'm actually gonna write that down. So... Uh... Guy who knifed, who shanked... Guy who shanked the captain... In the last chapter, lit the fuse during the doom. That's something. It's something. It's not the best. It doesn't give us a lot of info, but it's something. He was in a completely different compartment. But you're saying it isn't? You're saying it isn't? Okay, so let's go to the other death then. Let's go to the one... Can I see the memories again by visiting the body? Apparently I can. Cause of death, the ocean's bullshit! <laughs> Cause of death being a freaking crewmate, man. Being a crewmate. Well, this guy certainly seems like he, like, he sounded like he died crushed. He definitely didn't sound like he died any other way than crushed. But that still doesn't tell me who lit the, the fuse. Okay, so what you're saying is that this guy had fire because he was lighting this cannon, which, yeah, you're right. You're right. But who lit the fuse? This guy? The guy who died? The guy who died lit the fuse? And what happened to this guy? What happened to you? Where are you? Where is... No, for real. Where is he? The cannon was already sparked by him. The guy who died lit the cannon. But I don't know his name. I don't know his name at all. Okay, so I have to assume that there should be two bodies in here. One of them, top, top hat guy. The other one... Oh, hell yeah, I can open doors. The other one should be here. Can, can, we, all, can we be honest about it? It should be here. He got shot, point blank. He should be in this room. I don't see any bodies here, so he should be there. But now that I know that I can open the doors... Holy shit, wait, I'm gonna open all the doors. I'm gonna open every single door! Because there could be something here. In any of them. That's right for a loop too, the guy literally evaporates. He's not anywhere! He isn't here anymore! His body's just gone! I like a room without a cannon. I think the rooms don't have cannons. You're safe. The rooms don't have cannons. They're just right next to the cannon. Oh. Uh-huh. Uh-huh-huh-huh. 
We're gonna need a corpse there. We're gonna, the, the rooms are not giving me anything. Ooh, that one has blood. That one has blood. That one's gonna give me something. That one's definitely gonna give me something. Okay, blah, 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 blah. Blood. Blood room. Aha! We have another victim. Coward, I'll take the cannon room. You wanna sleep around the cannons? Oh no, you're cut. <laughs> Don't leave me. Bear up, son. I'll stay with you. T tell Pete's mother I, I... I tried my best. Aye. To pull him back, to save him. You tell her yourself. <laughs> Brennan, bring the surgeon's kit. <laughs> Oh, that's sad. That's sad, man. I I don't think he's going to make it. I don't think he's going to get to tell Pete's mom anything, buddy. I'm so sorry. Wait, is that the first mate? The first mate had a son. A son who... Well... Didn't make it. Just like everyone else. When was this? People are barely coming in. The cannons are all without you. Why did they kill this too? This is not the Kraken. This is not the Kraken. Keyword hard. Yep. Yeah. I. I don't. I don't think he's gonna get to tell Pete's mom anything, folks. I don't. I don't think it's going to be alright. Brennan surgeon's kid, so we can identify the doctor. Who is this, and how did they die? Oh no. You're cut. Don't leave me. Bear up, son. I'll stay with you. Wait! He's not his actual son. That's something that people say. Like, don't worry, son. We'll do this together. I don't... Mm, I don't think it was an actual son. I don't think I should hang on to that word. I don't think I should hang on to that word too strongly. Um, that's the first mate. That's what I'm thinking. That's the first mate. Um, it wasn't a murder. It was a massacre. Yeah, it was like, that's three people. Three people are killed here. Some smaller ships combined cook, surgeon, and carpenter. I, that doesn't sound right. That doesn't sound right. If there is a kraken, then a uh, mind controller rat can also exist. You know what? You're not wrong. You're not wrong. Yeah, son, it's just a matter of speech. Yeah, I don't, I, I shouldn't hang up. I, I shouldn't hang up to that word. I, I shouldn't get hung up on that word. Um, seeing as this was a crew of 51, I don't think they were lacking for crew that the carpenter is also the doctor. It doesn't sound right. Uh, this was a large enough, a large enough ship. Okay. You're cut. Don't leave me. Bear up. I'll stay with you. Tell Pete's mother I tried my best to pull him back to save him. So Pete died before this guy. You tell her yourself. Brennan, bring, this, bring the surgeon's kit. Here's the thing. Brennan might be the surgeon, right? Brennan could be the surgeon. Does the book say that at all? At any point? The crew. Yeah, okay. So the... the no, the surgeon is Henry Evans. The person that survives enough for me to have to take the book to them. Surgeon's mate, James Wallace. I'm assuming... If they're asking Brennan... Brennan... To come with the surgeon's kit. The surgeon by now is out of the picture. Not because he's dead, because apparently we can give the the book to him. But why would they ask anyone else to bring it? Brennan, 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 Brennan. I'm not finding a Brennan. Where is Brennan to begin with? Am I... Am I 
blind? I'm not seeing a Brennan. Henry Brennan, near the bottom of the list. Oh, Brennan is the second name. The last name. He was, yeah, he was a handman, not a, not a surgeon. They weren't pirates, it was a cargo ship. Oh, I'm not calling them pirates. Am I calling them pirates? Um, if you were a pirate and if you didn't have a pirate doctor that was educated in college with a medical degree, who else would you use for the doctor? A guy with a handy bone saw? The carpenter. If that's something that pirates did, I don't, I don't understand the fantasy of, like, wanting to be pirates then, because that sounds terrible. That sounds awful. Um... I thought your cursor was a bug on my screen and I tried to shoot it out! <laughs> you shoot my cursor, officer! I believe in you! You can do it! You can do it! Shoot off that mouse pointer! Where the hell are we going? Are you just coming here? Yes? Yes, perfect. If there was a Kraken, there are pirates. But these guys aren't pirates. These guys are not pirates. They were in the in with the Indian company or something. Ouchie. Okay, so this is... I would say this is where the mutiny started. But this isn't where the mutiny started though, right? Because the mutiny was way after the Kraken. And a lot of these people were already dead by the Kraken's point. Unless this happens before the Kraken. Wait, wait, wait. Let's see. Let's see the state of the... I can't see much. Because a lot of things are, like, blurred. Am I supposed to understand this happens after the Kraken? That guy was stabbed in the back. This guy is being clubbed in the head. He had a gun. Didn't work that well, but he certainly had one. We've seen that guy before, hadn't we? You're going back in time. So this was before the Kraken? Who is this and how did they die? They died clubbed by someone. By someone. Escape, 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 bargain, the doom. Okay, so this is after the Kraken. This is after the Kraken. The doom, bargain, escape. The end. Okay, so after the Kraken, they organized the mutiny. That makes sense to me. That makes sense to me. After the Kraken, they try to escape the boat with whatever they the shells are. And they organize a mutiny. This guy... This guy was a big part of the mutiny, so I'm surprised to not seeing him a lot right now. Oh, but he is the one killing... He's the one killing here, right? I think? Yeah, Beanie Guy! It's you again! Yeah! He was like the main character in the mutiny, huh? He was like the main guy organizing the mutiny. I really need to find out your name. I really need to find out your name. How how does the first mate? How does the first mate actually end up with him? Considering right now he was tending to someone who is dying because of this mutiny. Who I assume is this guy. This is Brennan, right? You Brennan? Yeah, you're Brennan. No, you're not Brennan. You're the, the guy who's dying. Son, your son, who is not actually referring to someone's son.
by Beanie Guy. It was Beanie Guy. The fantasy of being pirates is usually because rules at the time were so annoying. Always wear an overcoat in the Caribbean. Arrgh. Who 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 was making such rules though? Always wear an overcoat. That's that's ridiculous. You know, I think I'm gonna pick this game up myself. You should. I've seen enough where I don't want the mystery to be spoiled. Oh yeah, you should. You should. Oh no. Oh no. Oh. Because you discovered the mutiny. Oh no. Is this Benny guy? It doesn't look like Benny guy. You're not Beanie Guy. No, you're not Beanie Guy, but you're also not the first mate. Who are you? Uh, anyway, I'll come in. I think you really should. I think you should stop watching. Uh, we only have uh, about 15 minutes more, anyways. Um, and you know what? I, I really think you should finish this game. You're gonna have plenty of time before I pick it up again. Um, and also, I hope that you enjoy it. I hope that you get to enjoy it. Okay, so he discovered the mutiny, he started running, he got stabbed in the back, and then this other guy tried to help, and then he got shot in the face. The deaths are not randomized to our replayability? No, no, it's a crafted story. It's, it's a story that has to be crafted, therefore. You got shot in the face by a gun. By someone who isn't Beanie Guy, actually. Captain cannot be trusted. Do you have a plan? We take the ship and sail east. Fresh bastard. Wait! So he was organizing the mutiny. This guy was organizing the mutiny. He got killed. By someone defending the kid. He got killed by someone defending the kid. Not kid. Again, not kid. Wait. Who are we who are we going to follow now? I thought it was gonna be this. I thought it was gonna be this. Unless uh this is the guy uh, who is called Sun later on, so he doesn't die until he makes it into the room, right? That makes sense. That makes sense! Where why were you vibrating like that? Why were you vibrating like that? Am I supposed to... What am I supposed to do here, clock? What am I supposed to do here, clock? Why were you vibrating? Oh, am I supposed to go up? Is there anything up? Oh, the mutiny started fresh. At this, at this very moment. I thought they were barely planning it out. What's up with that? Okay, we are meant to follow this guy who got thrown overboard? Pushed? Who threw himself? There's a lot of blood, so I'm assuming somebody got... Okay, so this is someone who got stabbed and thrown off board. I would assume. I would assume! This was several days before that. At this point, you need to clarify what is this and what is that because I do not remember. <laughs> I do not remember. What is this and what is that? Wrestling over the pistol. It was still... It was still the person who... Okay. Let me, let me read the chat for a second here. The person who was talking about the mutiny got discovered. 
The person who got discovered, I'm assuming, is the person who got stabbed in the back. And then the guy who blew his head in, not in, off with a gun, was just defending the guy who got stabbed in the back. Beanie Guy, the ultimate dastard and villain of them all! He was, he was a pretty important part of the mutiny. The good old British Empire, uh, what? God, I'm so bad at this. Uh, wrestling over the pistol. I don't think it was wrestling. I think he just, he tried to kill it. Um, today's stream flew by. It, yes, it has flown by. This is get very engaging. This game is like, you, yeah. You get really hooked into it. Green Lampor, welcome and hello. How are you doing? Hope you're having a good day. Welcome. Ellie telling me not to watch, Ellie? I'm just, I'm just saying I don't want you to spoil yourself. Good thing I managed to catch your stream. I'm glad you could catch a little bit of Creed. X marks when the killed person speaks. Exactly, exactly. Uh, that's Sunny crawling away from the mutiny. We can check upstairs. Yeah, it was upstairs. So they are pirates? No, they're not. You could stop wasting time theorizing and just see what happened. Yeah, maybe. But what's the, what's the point in that? What's the joy in that? Uh, they chartered a ship of England East India Company before they were international drug dealers. They were with the Indian Trade Company, so it's very official. It's very official. It's not going to be pirates. Okay, so the person who's getting thrown off board is being shot by that woman. Who is trying to escape? Now I get it. Okay. So several people managed to escape on a little boat. This guy manages to, manages to escape on a little boat. That woman manages to escape on a little boat. As far as we know. And that guy... Isn't that Sonny? Isn't that Sonny? Who are you? Doesn't matter because you're about to die anyways, but you try to get in there and attack them, I assume, and you got shot by this woman. These people, are they pro-mutiny? That's Beanie guy. That's Beanie, so he, they have to be pro-mutiny. And that guy with the sword dies. The woman is just trying to get the fuck out of it. Yeah, she is. I wonder if they managed. I wonder if they did it. You think you're confused now? Wait until you pick it back up in a few days. Wait until I pick it back up in a week. You got shot. By a gun. By a woman. I don't know who. I don't know her name yet. And you. Who, who do you die from? Show me. Show me! Oh, right. It's gonna be right here. It's gonna be right here! Why do you need to do all of that? Just show me the body! Lina! Bienvenida! Welcome! How are you doing? Hi! The mutiny was happening above deck, then went below deck. Move quick. Okay. Okay. So they were stopped from escaping because they had the last boat. That is good information to have, actually. That is good information to have. You are that guy. Okay. And you are that guy who dies later on. You are... Yeah, the same woman. Oh, look, the child! Isn't that the child? Come on, come on, so in. Okay, so this guy's... I think this guy's all made it. I really do. I think they made it. I think they survived. At least it seems like they might have survived. Then this guy is... Very upsetting because your immunity is getting compromised, huh? Um, how's the murdering and mystery solving and gaming and black and whitening? It's 
going. My brain cannot keep up, but you know what? You know what? We're trying. Last one, move quick. Oi, you'll not take the last boat. Paul, look out. Stop, let him go. No, damn. Here's the thing, though. A part of me wants to go, oh, so this guy who died by knife was Paul. That's, that's the information that this thing is giving us. Oh, yes, I am sure. But I, I don't know. He could just be someone who, who saw them and offended them. Because... Because I don't know, because I'm afraid of putting down any information that isn't certain. I think I, my God is telling me that this should be Paul, right? Who died? Paul died? I don't know. Paul, so we have a name and Paul was killed. Uh, that's what I think. Don't mess with Martha. She has a gun. I wonder what her name is. I need to figure out her name. There are no children on board, but uh, th th that, that girl in the boat looks like a child. Next memory will be of the boat getting smashed to toothpicks by a tentacle. I hope not. No, this happens after the Kraken. This happens after the Kraken. Maybe she could be talking on her cell phone with someone. No, you know, not, not me. Welcome. Hey, hello. How are you doing? Hope you're having a good day. Welcome. That was Paul because of the other voice was calling him out. I'm 90% sure. I'm also 90% sure. You're not going to get anywhere. You seriously need to guess like 60% of the names. Okay, I, I'm going to assume that this is Paul. I'm, I'm gonna assume. I'm sure the game would love to give out blatantly misleading information. I mean, yeah. I feel like that's something the game would do. Man says that's the last one. Then the sailors comes in and stops him. Woman warns the man who lowers the last boat. Paul, look out. And then the man who was lowering the boat was stopped. I know, I know. It is very much implying that this is Paul. It's very much important that this is Paul. I'm just scared. I'm just scared of putting down information. So, Paul. Paul, Paul. 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 Paul? Paul? Am I doing the same mistake again of not reading the last names trying to find Paul? Without the not the last name. Paul, 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 Paul. Edward Martin John, Alfred Charles Henry, James, Winston Marcus, Thomas Emily Christian, Finley, Edward, Emily. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Paul! Paul. Paul was stabbed. Killed by a sword. By this guy who unfortunately i don't have a name for i know how he dies shot by the woman but that doesn't tell me his name that doesn't tell me his name okay who else oh downstairs downstairs here no wait this door's open have i seen that have i seen that before Paul 29. Yeah, I was sucking at reading, which is not surprising. It's not, not, not surprising at all. It tends to happen with me. I'm bad at, I'm bad at reading. Oh, these are the people discussing the mutiny, and this is the guy who got stabbed in the back because he was listening in. And I'm assuming this death is the thing that starts the mutiny. I'm assuming this is the death that starts the mutiny, uh actually developing here right here yeah it was there right i lost the little oh because you're so slow that's why i lost it obviously his full name is polomon i didn't take you for a digimon fan nami Watch the whole stream on two times speed to see how you're playing. Finally caught up. Oh, welcome to the present then. Welcome to the present. Man says that's the last one. Then the sailor comes in and stops it. Oh no, I read that. Put me down. Let me go. Easy now. You're in a bad way. This is squid. Where is my Frenchman? The squid's gone. 
Your mate was torn apart. Not that. The beast is dead. How? How did you kill it? We didn't. It left with the storm. The captain came up from the hold. Said he chased it off. <laughs> it was the captain! The captain was the wor the war kraken! like that if you die without anyone murdering you how am i supposed to know down your death how am i supposed to know down your death if you die without anyone murdering you okay you are the one who proposes i wish i i wish i recognized the hats how much of this game do you think you can solve just by looking at the hats what does this hat mean who are you i am sure that i could figure out your name if i knew what that hat means I am so sure. Are you Bini guy? No, your first mate. Okay. Oh, there's more place down. There's more place down. There's Sunny. Sunny, Sunny. Okay, so this guy died. What off? What killed you? What killed you? You're doing the mistake of being blind. Typical me. Typical me! Um, imagine there's a Paul in the chat and she keeps shouting Paul. I mean, that's gonna happen eventually, right? With some, some game is gonna have a name that one of you shares. Honestly, I was going for a Solomon reference by why wouldn't you take me for a Digimon fan? I don't know, because it's so rare to find Digimon fans in my experience. The goat uses magic powers to cast a storm? Wow. Wow. How did he die? I don't know. I mean, he's dead. For sure. But I don't know how he died. Let me look at... Put me down. Let go. You're in a bad way. The squid. Where's my Frenchman? The squid's gone. Your mate was torn apart. The beast is dead. How did you do it? It didn't. Blah, blah, blah. A curse like that. The so he died in the confrontation against the Kraken, I assume? But that doesn't tell me how he died or what killed him. He was roughed up, but that doesn't tell me anything. When there's a terrifying monster from the depths involved, he'll be there. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. The captain, the captain and the Kraken, you're gonna see him on the same place every time. Every time you're gonna see them together. So here's, here's the thing. That is the first time I have no idea what killed a person. There's a lot of blood. Let's see. There's a lot of blood. And it's mostly coming from his side. And he's missing an arm. Okay, so far so good. He's talking about the squid. So that must mean that he was in the confrontation with the Kraken. The blood comes all the way from here, but it stops. So it's from here. It's nothing in particular here that would give me an indication that it was, I don't know, the Kraken or whatever. He just starts bleeding at some point here, loses an arm, which is nowhere. I'm not seeing an arm. And then ends up here, dying from blood loss. He was murdered to death. They, yeah, I'm sure the game is going to allow me that. I'm sure. Return of the Obra hat. I'm using so many hats as markers. Clearly, this guy is a train conductor. I, It looks like a train. I honestly thought of it. I honestly thought like this guy reminds me of a train conductor. I'm sure it was like an actual important hat in the Navy. That's weird. It was an incredibly popular 2000 anime Zoomers and Millennials grew up with. Plus, it has some games. Yeah, but at least in my circles, uh, people were like either Pokemon team or Digimon team. And like they really didn't like Digimon. 
And I know that most people here are very into Pokemon. Just look at the guy. I am looking at the guy! He, he's clearly missing an arm. And he's talking about the Kraken. So I kind of can assume that it's the Kraken. But it doesn't necessarily tell me much. What did Dialogue say again? He's asking for his mate. He's like, I, where's my mate? Where's my Frenchman? The squid, where's my Frenchman? The squid's gone, your meat was torn apart. The beast is dead, how? How did you kill it? And then... And then, yeah, how how did you kill it? We didn't, it left with the storm. Came Captain came up from the hold, said he'd chased it off, you should rest. A curse like that does not live for nothing. Uh, I think what he means here is a curse like that wouldn't have just gone. So whatever the captain did, it actually chased him off. And what I'm going to assume that is that the captain, like, threw something in the water. Whatever the cap the kraken was attacking them for. The shells. Whatever these shells are. Kimberly Wong, welcome and hello. How are you doing? Hope you're having a good day. Welcome! Digimon Cyber Slow Stream when? What the fuck is that? Uh, I'm Pokemon and Digimon Team. Both are good. Pokemon has good games. Digimon has good story. I was thinking that Mrs. Conduct Mr. Conductor from Thomas. I don't know what you're referring to. Who's this Frenchman? I have no idea what Frenchman means. I'm assuming it is a boat term. Let me check out the crew and see if anyone is like called Frenchman as a like position in the boat. Carpenter, mate, cook, butcher, gunner, gunner's mate, purser, helmsman, artist. Steward, 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 midship, top man, seaman. Nobody's called Frenchman. So, he must be talking about the country. French, 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 French. There's no one from France, unless I'm misreading, which could be possible. Okay. England, Scotland, England, England, Austria, France. France, Charles Minor. Frenchman. This guy is Frenchman. England, England, America, England, Ireland, Austria, Poland, Scotland, England, Scotland, Italy, England, Formosa, India, Sweden, Wales, Ireland, England, 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 Persia, Scotland, China, England, New Guinea, England, Russia, England, Denmark, Wales, India, Sierra Leone. Okay, so there's only one Frenchman. There's only one Frenchman. And we know that this guy... And we know that this guy... Uh... Was it this guy? Yeah, okay, we know that this guy... Three memories. Uh, show memories. He's calling out for a Frenchman. Your mate was torn apart. Is this a tattoo guy? Is this a tattoo guy? You're a ship term. Am I? I don't know ship terms. I don't know. Wait a minute. I was joking about the captain. He's not actually. <laughs> no, I think he threw the the shells into the ocean, and that's what the kraken wanted. Um, the best roll aside from seaman, Frenchman. Now that I think about it, uh, turn-based battles, so you wouldn't like it. Typical. So Martha's alive, as far as we know. Yes, she is. Okay. So, Frenchman was torn apart by the squid. I'm going to go and write that down. It's uh, unconventional, but you know what? But you know what? The French guy was... Oh no, I'm supposed to identify him? I just... I mean... I could assume that that's the tattoo guy. I could assume that French guy is the 
shoot a two guy? Where is he? I, I'm going to assume stuff. I don't like it, but I'm going to. I need to find a two guy. We need to find a two guy. Charles Manner was torn apart. Sure. That's, that's, that's where we are going to kind of like. That's where we're going to assume stuff. Oh God. I don't like assuming stuff. I need to assume something about him too, because the, the thing is not really giving me much more. Unless I'm supposed to go find the door. Okay, let's find the door. Let's get out of here. I don't want to assume anything about it. Yeah, he was torn apart. Very much apart. I mean, he said, where's my Frenchman? He was torn apart by the squid, right? So that's, that's what I assume. Who was this? What fate will befell them? Who was this? What fail befell them? Four wayward souls disappeared during the events of this chapter. Their fates are cataloged here. I think they survived. I think she's alive. In... Oh. How would I know where? How the frick would I know where? Okay, wait. Um, we were... We were here. And the closest thing is the Saurus, Madeira, or the Canary Islands. I don't know where they would have gone. I'm assuming a Saurus is the closest thing. Minus 11 minutes? What the frick? When? When did that happen? It was a weird definition of the word assume. They're alive, so just ask them. I don't think you're gonna guess it at this point unless you really paid attention. Uh no. I probably won't. I probably will not. But that's weird. Why is it asking me where they are? I just I know that they're alive. Does that not count? These guys are alive! Why is that not enough? This is a dis deduction rating. What does that mean? A high rating means that it will be a more difficult to deduce this person's identity. Focus on the easily deducted identities first and leave the more difficult ones for later. Okay. Thank you for telling me that right now, at the very end of the stream, I guess. Alive Onosaurus. I don't know. I'm taking a guess. But it's, you know what? Before next stream, I have to come back and read a whole bunch anyways. I'm gonna have to go through the book a significant amount before I come back next stream. Because it's, it's time. It's time. Damn, I mean, wow. How did the time fly by so much? How, how, how did that happen? Damn, it just, it just completely went by. I'm having fun. I'm really glad that we're finally on this, on this game. I'm, I'm like, I'm liking it a lot. I'm really liking it. Um... I don't think you're gonna guess it at this point unless you really paid attention. I'm gonna I'm gonna come back to the book before the next time I play it. Before the next time I play it, I'm gonna come back to the book and like read all the information I have. She'll do her best, I'm sure. Someday she'll look at something and figure out who that something is. Because your investigator is sent to figure out what happened. I know, I know. I know! You think that because they're alive, that means they're not dead? Yes. Yes. I can I can confidently make that assumption. Uh, it's a really good game. It is. I'm really liking it. Also, during the explosion sequence, I wanted to ask if you think changing the filter on the screen could help. Like the Macintosh, just something else. 
Uh, I don't think that it's gonna change the aesthetics of the game. Every single picture that I've seen of the game is exactly that. Um, so I'm sure, I'm pretty sure that the aesthetic won't change, but I could try it. La next time that I play this game, when I have to like pre prep by reading the book again, everything that I have, I'm gonna uh, uh, see if the filters change anything. I sure can't wait to read books tomorrow. Oh, your books are arriving tomorrow. Your books are arriving tomorrow. Excite, excite. I, I, I can't even imagine waiting for a delivery. I, that's not, that's not something that happens to me. <laughs> Um, things are stream. Thank you for being here, Sylvie. People die when they're killed, and that's what we're seeing over and over in this one. Imagine a detective saying that. Where's my baby boy? Look, lady, he's definitely alive. Isn't that good enough? With another like 60 people that I have to figure out, just knowing that they're alive should be enough, man. <laughs> Sadly, no matter what filter you choose, the game will always be painful to look at. I that's what I'm assuming. Take the video filter thingy, it's pretty significant. From that yellowing black to complete black and white and maybe some other colors. I'll check it out, I'll check it out. Next time when I'm reading the book to prep for the stream, I'll check it out. Alright, I'm going to Karen, thanks for the stream. Take care, I hope that you have a great night. I hope that you feel very rested tomorrow. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you for uh, the patience. <laughs> Thank you for the patience! And I hope that you enjoyed, and I hope you have a good night. Uh, but yeah, it's a it's a it's a very complex kind of mystery game, and I know I know that that's kind of my weakness, right? Like I I know where my weaknesses lie, and one of my weaknesses is paying attention to detail, and another one of my weaknesses is remembering the small stuff, and another one of my <laughs> weaknesses is thinking just in general thinking is another one of my weaknesses uh and you're gonna see all of that all of that uh in this game like pretty much pretty much the entire time it's going to be just me struggling to remember ellie's only weakness using her smarts ellie's ellie's weakness trying to do anything with her brain yep that's pretty that that sums it up. That sums it up nicely. Um I am enjoying it though. I am enjoying it regardless. Dan C, welcome. I love how are you doing? Hope you're having a good day. Welcome, welcome! You unfortunately arrived at the end of the stream, but uh I hope that you're having a good day. I hope that you have a good day after this. I don't know for how long we're gonna keep being here doing the wrap-up, but yeah, that's that's where we're at. You're not dumb, you're just smart in a different way. Uh, you know what? You might say that as a joke, but I, I genuinely... That's how I see it. That's how I see it. People think that smart is one type of smart, but in reality, there are many. There are many. Uh, no sis, no weaknesses. Just stats that aren't maxed out yet like everything else. Stats that aren't maxed out and that I do not feel any interest in uh putting skill points towards mas maxing out i have many other things that i have to max out i have to max out my linguistic skill first and most importantly i like this game a ton i watched a let's play a way long time ago and only wanted to play it myself when i knew i forgot a ton i probably can go back to it now but i still remember plenty it's one of those things right that you just you just want to like let time go by and forget it all but the problem is the more you actually care about something and the more you want to forget it it feels like it's the things that you will forget the least i have i have books that i read before that i felt the exact same way i was like oh my god i want to i really hope that i forget all about this book so that i can read it again as if it was the first time almost and I find myself having that situation, but with things I didn't really enjoy that much the first time. And so, it's disappointing because the thing that you really, really, really want to experience again. You really want to experience it again because you loved it so much. But because you loved it so much, you remember it well enough for a long time. Ellie found the detail that I didn't though. The first maid's last name through Abigail's first last name instead of her married last name. That's... 
I, that's the, the that's kind of like the tutorial segment though. I'm not proud of that. Uh, thanks to the stream, I'll have to find a different white noise now. And that is, you are here. Hi, how are you doing? I hope you enjoyed. I hope you have a good day. I hope you had a good day. And thank you so much. Ali pumps strength and charisma by making perception and luck dump stats. I wouldn't say luck. I wouldn't say luck, but I would say intelligence. Honestly, I think the bigger issue is now there's some streamers playing it again. So now I'm just watching a let's play again. Ah. Ah, so it's gonna be harder to forget yet again. Nowadays, I do happen to run into a situation where I see something I completely forgot about in something I have seen before, which I did not think was possible some years back. Oh, I definitely... I definitely don't trust memory. I, I always know that at some point you're gonna forget stuff. But it seems like the stuff that you care about and that you want to forget is the one that it takes the longest to forget. I wish I could forget everything about Skyrim and play it again. Yeah, like that. Like your favorite games and stuff like that. Actually, I think I'm at the point where I could replay Thomas Was Alone, which is one of my favorite games. And I don't think I remember much of it. Unfortunately, I remember enough about like the big things where to the point where it's probably not going to be the experience I want it to be of rediscovering those things. But I have forgotten most of it. So maybe I could consider it. Um, last year being very stressful probably did not help either. Oh, yeah. I wish I could forget Skyrim and not play personally. <laughs> You just hate scarring that much? You just you just hate it. You just don't like it. There's some fun things I still remember from way long ago and figuring things out, but I, I obviously wouldn't want to mention them with Ellie Rain Chat. Oh no no no, don't mention it, don't mention it. We are we're gonna keep it like as spoiler free as possible. We're not going to Here's the thing. I do think you guys are gonna have to help me a little bit. I do in fact believe that there are some things that I'm gonna need help with. But I want to try and figure it out on my own. I know that it's not going great. I, I know that I'm not super well right now. But I believe, I believe, I have faith that as I keep going... Ah, ah, sorry. I have faith that as I keep going, a lot of this... Is finally gonna start clicking for me, even if it's, uh, you know, not 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 the easiest for my brain. Best part of mystery puzzle game streams is seeing how fellow gamers figure stuff out. I hope that I don't frustrate people though, because my way of figuring it out is until I have, like, I don't figure it out until it's like right next to my face, until it's right there and it's impossible to deny it anymore. <laughs> I hope that I figure out the stuff faster than that. I really do. I really hope. But you know, I would just say don't don't count on it. That's that's what I would say. Don't, don't just don't count on it. Cute yawn. Thank you. Memory is weird. I can remember all the Gen 1 Pokemon, even though I haven't played it in 20 years. My new phone number that I've been using for the last few months? Ha! <laughs> no. Yeah, that's, that's a kind of weird thing. It depends entirely on your emotional bonding. Like... The only reason I remember my own cell phone is because I've had it for so long. And the only reason I remember my own, like, national ID number is because there have been moments in my life, periods in my life, in which I needed to use it so much. Like, every single day, multiple times a day. To the point that I... I don't want to say that I memorized it though, because the reason I, I remember my identification number so easily is because I noticed that specific pattern on it. But there was a point, that at that point in my life, where it was so important to use this number, identification number, every single day, several times a day. I learned by memory, like the number of like three people immediately gone as soon as I finished that chapter of my life. Memory is just weird. If you end up enjoying Oberdin, you may consider playing the case of the Golden Idol sometime. I feel like if you like one, you'll like the other. Well, I have never heard of that one. 
The case of the golden idol. I have never heard of that one. Old Redina had heard before because like everyone talks about this game. Like it's very well regarded by pretty much the entire indie community. Oh, the case of the golden idol. Wasn't this one on a fest very recently ago? Very recently ago. That's not how you say it. Uh, but I, I think this was very recently showcased in a fest or something. I think I remember seeing that game cover. The poker app helped a lot. Right, that was a thing. Again, I wasn't into Pokemon, so... Don't worry, I didn't get that frustrated. To be honest, what bummed me out... Uh, the last stream I watched on this game was that she let herself get lots of help from chat. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna try to solve it myself. I want to solve it myself. I really do. Uh, I, I will only ask for help from chat if I feel absolutely 100% lost and it mostly I mostly try to ask very specific questions when that happens Don't know but 99% uh, positive reviews. What? Holy shit. Really? 2022 adventure and puzzle video game <laughs> ah. So it's it's pretty new it's pretty new, um, and and it's. I'm gonna be honest. I don't think I remember seeing any other game with 99%. That is insane. That is a lot. 99%. Holy shit. Um, I discovered about procedural memory recently and some memory tricks. Procedural memory. I want to watch yourself solve this whole... I want to watch you yourself solve this whole mysteries. Exactly, that's the point. That's the point. If I'm just... If I'm just letting chat solve it for me, then what's the point of me playing it with chat, you know? I, I'd rather... I'd rather be able to ask specific questions when I feel very stuck. But other than that, I really want to use my knocking. I really want to force those wrinkles. I really want to grow those wrinkles. Are they trying to beat us with cuteness? No, I'm just tired. I'm trying to fix my sleep schedule. I've been trying to fix my sleep schedule and it's so difficult. Uh, Frederick, welcome. My hello, how are you doing? Hope you're having a good day. Welcome. You did arrive at the tail end of the stream, unfortunately. But I hope you have a good day. I hope you've had a good day. And I hope that you feel very well rested tonight. Uh, still just to cover up for her real person that only gem polishers know about though. Shush! That's not true! That's not true! Wrinkling brain is like muscle exercise. Oh, I'm trying to wrinkle it. I'm trying to wrinkle it so much. Still messed up from the endurance stream? No, it was messed up way before because of the prep for the endurance stream. It's, my sleep schedule has been messed up for like a month or two now. It's a struggle. I'm trying to get it better. I think by now I have shaved off half an hour? Yeah. I think I've fixed half an hour's worth of sleep schedule. I still have about an hour and a half to go of fixing. Yeah. Heroico had a 110% positive review. That's not true. That's not true. Shut up. There's no... Okay, let me go to the store and look at it. Because that's not true. Let me, let me check, let me check, uh, 88%, it's 88% for Eroico, what are you talking about? What are you talking about? It's just 88. Alright, I still need to watch the 8 hour streams, well you don't need to, you don't need to, don't, don't force yourself. I've never had that much trouble with sleep schedule, I had run-ins with insomnia. And my Yoshi can wake me up multiple times a night, sure. But to willingly not go to sleep, very, very, very rare for me. It's less about willingly not go to sleep and more by the time you realize it's 2 a.m. And you're like, how the frick did this happen? And, and you feel like you didn't use your time effectively. And then you have to wake up early the next day anyway. So you're sleeping six hours or five hours. And you're zombified the next morning. And so you don't work as, as well as you need to. Etc. Etc. I pretty much uh, do not function at night, even parties or game nights. I don't think I had 10 in my life. Also, I cannot sleep when the sun is up. 
I can sleep with the sun is up only because I have blinds everywhere. I, as I've said before, I can't sleep with light. I cannot. If I need to have the blinds up for some reason, like maybe it's too hot outside and you need a breeze, whatever. I'm gonna have a blindfold right next to me because I cannot sleep with night with, with light, any amount of light. But as far as like night, morning person, all of that goes, regardless of how tired I am, at night it's incredibly difficult to feel tired. Even if I'm tired throughout the entire day, like the entire day I could be a zombie and I could feel very tired. But when night hits, I'm just really awake. I don't know. Even if I were to go to sleep at 5 a.m., I still wake up before 7. Is it because of the light? You should get yourself a blindfold, just like me. Zombie Ellie, when though? Hopefully never. I, I, I don't want to come here being a zombie. I want to sleep and be well rested and be able to actually, you know, engage, engage with chat and with what I'm doing. Um, but, guys, it is now half past and uh, I am going to go. I have things to buy for tomorrow and things to do for tomorrow. What if eating brains makes you smarter? Hmm. Wait, why would I eat brains? I don't want to eat brains. Oh, because zombie. See, I'm too stupid to even notice that correlation. <laughs> um, but yeah, guys. I'm gonna go now. Thank you so much for being here. I hope that you enjoyed. Oh, hey, YouTube didn't allow my last chat to pass. What? No, you guys are still having issues with that. Did anyone still have issues with that? I need to know. I need to know if you guys had, had problems. Um. But yeah, I'm gonna go now. You guys go rest or sleep or work or whatever you have to do after this. But I thank you so, so much for being here. I hope that you enjoyed. Uh, only two messages were deleted. Okay, so it's getting better. Is that what I'm hearing? That it worked? That it got better? That it, that it definitely worked? And that we don't have to be afraid of that anymore? Am I getting too optimistic? Did we fix it? Um, to be fair, I complained that I can't believe I got baited into adding a prawn game into my search history. Ah, uh, well, that that word might be caught automatically. That that might be an automatic word that just YouTube itself has as a filter. I had fear issues of late. You bribed the new boss? No, I did what you guys told me about the filter list. <laughs> Turned out, I had a filter list that was 3,000 words long and you guys convinced me to uh, turn it off. I didn't turn it, I'm gonna confess, I didn't turn it off. I, there, there are still some words in that list. However, I made sure to leave practically nothing but the, the big, like, slurs. You know, that's what the list is. It used to be 3,000 words. Now it is 700. It's a lot less. And it's mostly, mostly, you know, uh, terms that certain people would call other groups of people, which are very bad and no, no good. So I think it's gonna be fine now. I think it's going to be fine. I think that should be the fix. Makes sense, still freak whoever mentioned the inappropriate game. I knew nothing about... Um, well, fun fact, I did make sure that the entire list of filter words did not have the word fuck on it. Because if I get to say the word fuck, I think you should get to say the word fuck. But if it doesn't allow you to say the word fuck, that might be a, a YouTube censor thing. And not a, not a me thing anymore. Not a me thing. Not a filter that has to do with me and my list, but a, a YouTube automatic thing because, like, honestly, honestly. Guys, how we're saying goodbye. Why are we talking again? I like saying fork personally. Yeah, that's a good that's a good substitution. I have an emotional bond to substituting it by fork because of the good place. Which I really love. But guys, I really I, I was gonna leave. Well, we can't say the F word, so it's a YouTube thing. That's, that's what I mean. Some of the things I assume are gonna be like specifically on YouTube side.
Some of the things I assume are gonna be on YouTube side because, like, I, I thought it was ridiculous. If I say it, that you guys couldn't say it, but, you know. I'm gonna go now! I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. Um, I hope that you feel well rested after this. Thank you so much for coming! I hope you had fun. Um, until next time, my, which might be tomorrow, could be tomorrow, uh, for any of you who come tomorrow, I'm going to have the spicy noodle challenge plus the disgusting eating thing challenge. So I'm slowly going to be running off the member goals and I'm scared. But regardless of that, I'll see you the next time. Don't forget to stretch. Don't, so how many hours I gotta polish the shed? <laughs> It's not, you're not being forced to do it. It's a privilege. Getting all the summer trauma out of the way in one day, huh? Exactly. You, you and me, same brainwave. That is exactly why I put it both in the same, I put them both on the same day. It's just not something I want to deal with for any extended period of time. I want them both gone tomorrow. <laughs> what the fuck was that? I don't know if you guys heard that. That was a very weird sound. It's a privilege to serve me, classic tyrant. It's not! It's not! Pay no, uh, pay no mind. I'm not in your walls. I, I legitimately don't know if you guys heard it or not, but it did sound like it was something in the walls. It sounds like it was something in the tubes. I don't know. Maybe I'm paranoid. I don't know. Anyways, I'm gonna go now for real. For real this time. For real this time. I'm gonna go. I hope you have a great rest of your day. Please don't forget to stretch. Please don't forget to drink plenty of water. Try to eat nutritiously and try to sleep seven to nine hours. And most important of all, be kind to yourself and others, all right? Um, take care, Mrs.